every morning before the sun comes up. You can find Don Kazda sitting outside Tuvalu Coffee House on South Main Street in Verona. <laughs> if you've lived here long enough, you've seen him out here for the past 19 years with a signature wave. It's a normal person. <laughs> That's how he describes himself. But everyone knows this friendly neighborhood crossing guard. They know my name, I don't know them. <laughs> Aside from helping people cross the street. I sit here and wave at the people. <laughs> every single person, without missing a beat, his favorite part, the kids. It don't make no difference if I have one or 20. His least favorite part. Cold weather. <laughs> he sits here when school is in session, rain or shine, snow or sleet, for 19 years. I used to work up to school and I, a guy told me, he said, why don't you be crossing guard? So I, I started in 2000. Don was a custodian here before he retired. Now the principal here was not available for an on-camera interview today, but says that the entire time that Don worked here, he would always try his best to build relationships, say hello, and even after he retired, he would still come by to say hi. Shocker, right? Right. He's become so accustomed to sitting in his spot every day, his friends at Tuvalu welcome him to free coffee whenever he wants. We want everyone to feel welcome here, and we appreciate what he does. Gina Kleiser has seen him sitting outside every day for the past year that she's worked here. Before that, she would be in one of the many cars driving past him, seeing that signature wave. Because he, he'd always wave to me, I'm like, I, I felt special. <laughs> but he waves to everybody, he's a sweetheart. When I asked when he might retire for real. I don't know. <laughs> until he decides you can pick out this friendly neighborhood crossing guard at his signature spot with that signature wave. In Verona. Sweet, kind, generous, part of the community. Jamie Perez, News 3 Now. <laughs>